As coaches, we like to hit backside seams, especially when we see safeties moving with the motion right here. So um, we'll do this a variety of different ways. We'll do this with a slot. We'll do this with a tight end. Um, we'll do this from different alignments, but basically we're going to have some sort of rocket motion this way, try to occupy a safety's eyes. It could be a single high safety that's moving. And then we've got one-on-one -on -one with an outside linebacker. It could be a two high safety set where the safety on this side is spinning down because of the motion. And this backside safety is working across to the middle of the field because this safety is spinning down right here. But we're going to open up right here, drop have our eyes this way and then try to hit a backside seam right here. So here it is right here. We've got rocket motion with our tailback. Quarterback's going to look off that way. A lot of times we see safeties moving with that. So then it creates one-on-one -on -one with an outside linebacker. It's a good little window for us to hit right there. Another one right here with Tom motion. You can see they're, they're playing some aggressive man-to-man -man type defense right here. The safeties come up quite a bit. And then we're able to hit that window right there. Another one right here. You can see the safety open up his shoulders. The middle safety right there sees the motion, opens up. And now that creates that one-on-one -on -one with one of our best athletes with an outside linebacker right there. Good ball right there. Next one right here. Now this team here, this is one of these teams that tried to work hard to take away rocket sweep. So they've got a corner pressed up here and they've got their safety way out here. So what they're trying to do is they are trying to have two on the edge and as motion comes, the safety is going to start to walk down. And what that ha what happens then is that opens up the middle of the field for our seam right there. And it's a great opportunity, but we've got to complete those passes right there. But I just wanted to show this one to show you a team that tried to overplay stopping Rocket and how we try to take advantage of that. Another one right here, safety is over the football. Turns his shoulders a little bit. We've got one-on-one -on -one with a linebacker on the back side. And that safety is just too far out of position. As soon as he turns his shoulders right there, we've got him beat. Now, this is one where we're utilizing the tight end. And actually, in this game, we, we kind of snuck our tight end, our, our best receiver, down as a tight end to get a little more speed here. But we've got Tom Motion coming this way. We're still in a two-by-two two set, but we're a tight end, two-by-two. Two. Quarterback looks off. Safety's late back to it. And now we've got some extra speed there by sneaking our wide receiver there. Another one right here down by the end zone. You can see these safeties are rotating with the motion. Another tight end two-by-two two set right here. And he's wide open for a touchdown. Safety's just too late. As soon as he motions here and starts to look that way, outside linebacker doesn't run with him. We're in the end zone for a touchdown. And then this one here, we've got two on the back side with this motion coming from a stack set. You can see the safety moving with the motion. Outside linebacker doesn't go with the seam, and now the seam's open for a touchdown. Now with this, with our seam scheme, we start to build a little bit of almost four verts, two verts right here to try to take advantage of single high safeties that are moving with the motion. We like to do this a lot with um, our tight end sets right here. So what we're going to do is we're going to have Tom motion come through right here. We're going to run basically a dart here. We're going to run an outside release seam here, outside release seam here. Uh, we might go four verts with this here or run a hitch right there to occupy that corner. 
but we're going to have motion coming this way to create some sort of safety um, attention this side of the field. We're going to look to try to hit this backside um, player right here away from the motion. Here it is with motion going away from us. There's the release of our slot on this side. And you can see here, this is a 3-3 three, three stack defense. Their safety is playing over our slot. Corners playing wide at the top right there into the, into the boundary. And our quarterback here does a good job of recognizing that safety staying in the middle of the field. And what that allows for us is our tight end has leverage right here. Our quarterback does a great job getting it into our tight end. Another one right here where our quarterback really threw to the wrong side of the field right here. I would have probably taken the backside seam right here to our slot. He throws to the tight end. Our tight end makes a tough catch right there. But really, I think if we throw backside right here, we probably have a touchdown depending if we can beat that corner. And then another one right here with another tight end set. And you can see, again, they're cheating their safety to the middle of the field. Our quarterback recognizes that. And that leaves our tight end right here on that seam open. Couple more right here. Now we're releasing both slots. Well, the slot on the dart and then our tight end and our slot right here. And this is one again that, you know, we've got a great release right here. The safety's out of position. We get pressure though, and that, that keeps us from completing this pass right here. Now this one's out of trips. Now we're getting into more of like a four vertical set out of trips where the tight slot's going to run a post to the middle, to the hash. Our outside receivers are going to run fades. And what we want to try to do here is try to hit our number two up the seam right here. And there he is up the seam. Safety moved out of the middle of the field because of the motion right there. And we'll see this quite a bit with trips where they're playing single high at times. Coaches, I really hope you got some great information from that YouTube video. Again, hit the subscribe and like button down below. It gives us valuable data, and you also get notified when I upload new content to this channel. Thanks for watching, coaches.